Hey coach, if you're watching this and you operate a soccer club or a soccer organization, this video within five minutes, I'm going to show you five different revenue streams that can help you grow the income of your soccer club. And these are five things that a lot of club directors, club owners that I've talked to, they are doing these newer types of ideas and they've implemented these in their business and they're seeing huge growth in their uh, soccer academies. So watch this, pay close attention, and we're going to go through this within five minutes. So the first is supplemental technical training. So I made a very long in-depth video about this. If you go into the first link in the description, you'll see our roadmap on how you can make 10K per month, uh, upwards to like 40K per month through your clubs, coaches that you already have, um, and how to put together uh, group training as far as technical training that's offered on top of what parents are signing up for as far as like teams, normal practices, games, registration fee. You can stack that into the registration fee as an option and a percentage of the parents will take that. But I have a longer video. Go down in, in the description. You'll see that longer video. I show you step by step how to set that up. Uh, within your club academy. Uh, the second, this is a really overlooked idea. Um, and a lot of club academies just simply don't offer this. And you can make a lot of money doing this. It is one day or multi-day camps and clinics that are offered throughout the year. So on holidays, Christmas break, spring break, um, you could even have something that's just offered like every Friday or once a month on Fridays. And there's these big opportunities that you're missing right now that you could be doing. And those types of things can generate thousands of dollars every time you run them. And you can flip around and pay the coaches that, that run these things just hourly. So there's huge profit margin with camps and clinics. And the great news is you already have access to all of the parents that would want something like that. And oftentimes these parents are looking for other camps and clinics provided by other businesses. So you could just keep all of that in house with your soccer academy. All right. Uh, the next one, this is something you might be doing. Um, most club academy directors and owners that I've talked to, they're not doing this enough, which is you rent out the fields for three on three tournaments, or you rent them out to other businesses that use them during the year. In this way, like you're already paying for the field. All right. But what we can do is we can, we can grab some of that money back from the overhead that you're already spending through companies that rent out the field from you. So they're just subleasing from you. So you might be able to charge a thousand or two thousand dollars per month just with that for one business. So they're using your fields on off nights or off days that you're not using it. Because think about it, the fields that you have, you're not operating those 24 seven. And if you're not, you should be utilizing the off hours to generate revenue within the company. Uh, next one, um, it's a pretty obvious one, but it's hosting more tournaments. So that doesn't mean you have to have your own tournaments for your own club, but that could be recreational tournaments. That could be three on three tournaments. Um, that could be any sort of tournament that's happening outside. It could be flag football, football. It could be anything. Um, as long as the, the folks who are signing up for that, like percentage of that is coming, uh, to your company. And we've seen that like most fields out there just are not being utilized and maximized. So that's a great opportunity. Should be doing that. In my opinion, you should be hosting a tournament, something like that, probably 10 to 12 times per year. Um, on average, you can generate thousands of dollars for stuff like that. All right. Uh, and the last one here, it's kind of a different idea. Um, I see some club soccer organizations try to do this. I don't feel like they do it that well. Um, but here's the idea. All right. Most kids that are like 14, 15, 16, 17 years old, that are playing club soccer, they have aspirations to go play in college. And most clubs, what they do is they have this like college seminar night where they just pull out this handbook. They talk about um, how to get recruited. And it's a very like watered down. There's no personalization. Um, there's no hands on teaching or guidance. It's basically just this presentation and then that's it. And then like the parents, at that point, if they want more help, they go hire out another company to help their son or daughter for consulting to get scholarships. Scholarships are worth six figures now. So the way we break it down is you want to build a legit recruiting mentorship program within the club. And it doesn't even have to be 
the club that puts it on, you can partner with a legit company where basically you're just the affiliate partner, where you bring them on, everybody who pays uh, your affiliate partner, you get a uh, commission, so you get a cut. And that way you're basically handing off that service to someone else who specializes in that, and they're really good at it, and they're really good at getting results with that. Or you have someone on your staff that becomes that person that can generate hundreds and thousands of dollars of new revenue for you versus just having this watered down version of like a one night thing per year. All right. A lot of kids need hands on help and it's pretty fair investment. Like they can invest two to five K into a mentor that can help them do that to get a hundred thousand dollars scholarship. It's a really good uh, investment for parents. Parents want that sort of thing. So if your club doesn't have that right now, adding that in along with the other things that we talked about, these things can help you add so much more revenue to your business. And the best part is everything that I'm showing you here, profit margin is very high, all right? Most clubs, and I talked about this in the technical training video, if you go down in the description, you'll see that, but most clubs operate at a very low profit margin, all right? They have so many expenses and adding these things don't require a ton of time, but the profit margin goes up, all right? So that's something that I want you to pay close attention to. So profit margin goes up when you add these things. It doesn't go down, all right? Uh, last here, if you are watching this and you're a club director, you're a club owner, and you want to grow your academy, you want to add these little things that we talked about into your business and grow your income, reach out to me. I'm working with five club organizations this year in 2023 and next year in 2024. My goal is to help you implement this help your academy make a lot more revenue um, within the year. And if you are interested, message me at the number that you'll see right below in the description. That is my cell phone. Reach out to me anytime you want. And I'm happy to take a 10 minute phone call with you to learn more about you, what you're doing with your academy and see if we're a good fit to help. That's it. See you later.